And here we go. Hold her tight. Say, why did I order an impact <laughs> instead of this? I'm gonna try and put all three on that other pellet. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's so awesome, dude. man. <laughs> Holy crap. I know, I told you it's gonna be bad to the bone. <laughs> you know, I'm going squirrel hunting right now. I should just take this. You should. <laughs> you would love it, man. You should. <laughs> no, no, no. it up and take it. All right, we got Steve here. I'm putting this right over to the happy face. Oh boy, it's going to full auto. The uh, LCS. So, so am I holding right on? Cause yes, my hold, camera's down there. Hold it right on, buddy. Again, got to thank uh, Ken Hicks so much. All right, I love going, it, buddy. I'm going for the hand grenade. Okay. Oh, safety. Yep. Oh, ho, nailed it. He's playing music down there with the steel. And he's hitting the grenade. Yeah. Let's see if you can see that stuff down there. I'll try to zoom in. Oh, out. Out. Oh, I love it. These uh, LCSs hold the same bottle as the uh, FX also, which is nice because being I have five F FX guns, <laughs> I can bring a couple extra bottles when we want to play with this thing. The only problem is, is I'm going to really be putting, keeping Richard from uh, JSB in business because you go through pellets like there's no tomorrow here. It's a 25 caliber. It holds 19 rounds. Um, it shoots either semi or fully auto. This cylinder here um, rotates like a revolver as you're loading it from the other side. This hint lever right here uh, makes it where you can't spin this backwards. So after you're done loading it, you flip this down, this down, cover, and uh, you're ready to fire. Play a little music here. Did you get it on single fire? Yep. You ready? Yep. We're going to bounce from target to target. Okay. It's just, you cannot believe how accurate this gun is for a semi and a fully auto. I'm going to do a fully auto round next um, and see how many times I can stay on that little plate. What is that, four inch plate, Steve? Uh, I think. I, I have no idea. Oh, okay. It looks, probably is. Probably it is. looks like a four inch plate, but we're going to uh, put this on fully auto next and um, see if we can keep it on that plate. So here we go. I think you did it. It looks like I did it. 
Let's go check it out. Yeah, man, that'd be amazing. I'll say it's got quite a few hits on it. And if you look at the pipe surrounding it, no hits on the pipe surrounding it. And you can see where the leads hit the target and splatted it off the fence post. I was just walking back to Norm and I found this little guy on the ground. If you look up at the silo right there, there's a dual metal target with a smaller diameter and a larger diameter. That target is used to sight in at 300 yards. That's what all the little pellet fragments on the ground are from. How's it going there, Norm? Good. I'm filling her back up. That is the second time I've smacked my head right there. <laughs> See, I can do jumping jacks under that and not touch it. I, I know you could. <laughs> Steve here, Aragon Evolution. How's He's going to try the uh, LCS on full auto this time down at four inch steel. And that's, that's got to be at least three, four, four five, I'd say every bit of 500 yards, right? Not exactly. Uh, maybe you're looking through I, the scope at 30 power, but I think it's more like 45 yards. <laughs> I think I might need to get a new range finder then. My, I, yeah. I don't know. That's every bit of 400 if you ask me. Uh, this is getting lighter and lighter with each oh trigger Oh my god. Pull. I'll tell All you. All right, so we got the, uh, the switch to full happy uh, fire here. I'm gonna just try and do burst. I'm gonna go in some bursts. Okay. Some bursts and uh, some singles. See how this trigger is. Okay. Yeah, nailed that one. This, uh, get this up a bit higher there. There we go. Now I've lost it. Maybe. Maybe I was right. <laughs> I don't know. I know you hate to admit that. <laughs> <laughs> all right, yeah. all right. I'll go back to where you had it. There okay. we go. All right. Oh, I love shooting that grenade. It's the grenade has the same profile as a pigeon body, so pigeons are in deep trouble. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Steve's got him ricocheting all over back there. Oh, That's there it. we go. Oh my god. And this this grip on here, check this grip out. It's amazing for a factory grip. It just oh, goes yeah. right I in there. It. Goes right in there. You got the this uh, competition, I don't know, is that a competition style trigger? Or? Yeah, it looks like it's adjustable, like you can slide it up and down. Yeah, this thing is just amazing. Beautiful carbon fiber. Oh yeah. You know, I don't know man, you are good at getting toys and it's hard to keep up with you. <laughs> well, this one came from uh, Ken... SPAW. Yeah, well Ken Hicks uh, hooked it up and got it right out to me. Okay. Let's try and hook a. Let's try and hook a. A, a thing. You know what I'm talking about. Handle. A, a, a scope. Uh, Side shot. Yes. Oh. A little crooked. It's hitting this nut here. Oh, we can cut that off. I've got a saw. So this. Let me see if I can. If I can tighten that just a smidgen more. This tin of pellets was full about what 30 minutes ago. Yeah. 30 minutes, 30 minutes. My glasses on so I don't blow anything up here. So what you're saying is to stand behind you. Yes, always. I'm going to fill it up to 250. Good thing I got the big bottle out today for this gun. Yeah. She likes uh, eating air. Air and pellets. And, oh my god, the air's a lot cheaper. <laughs> I'm going to go uh, one shot at a time at first. Here we go. Pull the grenade here, see if we can get a ricochet. Let's see if there's any jump. Oh yeah. Oh, we hear some ricochets. Oh, 
Oh yeah. Oh, out. So I'm gonna fill this up again, even though it's at uh, 200 bar, uh, they say don't run this below uh, the 150 reg. And fully auto sucks up the air pretty, pretty fast, so I just wanna be safe and not hurt the gun in any way. And you get quicker and quicker loading that magazine up too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a little awkward at first, and then pop, what, four in, spin it, pop oh, yeah. four more in, yeah, spin it. it it goes pretty quick now, but one thing I definitely suggest if you're going to buy one of these is uh, order the 580cc bottle instead of the 480, because that's going to be my next purchase. I have this uh, LCS on full auto, and I'm going to see if I can put all 19 rounds on that steel pulley. Here we go. Hold her tight. Boy, it goes so fast, I can't tell. And here we go. Hold her tight. Boy, it goes so fast, I can't tell. I'll go look at Could you hear it, Steve? Um, I've got the, that plate tethered down. So oh, okay. Right 